my name is John Lisbaris. <clears throat> I live at 142 Hackett Hill Road in Hooksett. I've been a resident of this uh, great community since 1991. I will be registering a formal complaint that I would like you to consider this evening, and I have copies of my complaint of, uh, for the record if you wish. I grew up on the west side of Manchester, graduated from West High School in 1980. I'm a United States Air Force veteran and served my country from 1981 to 86 in Texas, Mississippi, California, and at that time, West Germany. I graduated from New Hampshire Technical Institute in Concord and the University of New Hampshire in Durham, and currently employed as an embedded software engineer in Andover, Massachusetts. I volunteered my time extensively for the town of Hooksett, having coached soccer and baseball in this community for over 10 years. Volunteered as a baseball umpire, Boy Scout leader with troop, local Troop 292. Volunteered to install playground equipment and baseball field at the Hooksett Memorial School. <clears throat> I'm currently president of the Manchester West High School Booster Club, uh, where a great deal of positive change is going on as we speak which directly impacts hooks at high school students as well as those students from Manchester. My point is, I love this community. I'm an active participant in this community to make it a better place for its citizens, and especially the children. I'm here tonight not because I want to be here, but because I have been following the police commission issues from a distance for the past few years, and with a limited amount of personal time for my family, I was unable to dedicate the time to come to these meetings and become an active participant. Through the diligence of one man documenting the commission meetings that were open to the public through the use of videotape, I have been able to formulate my own opinion as to the reason for the problems our current police force is having. My complaint is simple. I, as a taxpayer in this town, am tired of seeing my hard-earned money used to train new police officers only to see those same police officers take jobs in surrounding communities. Soon after the town puts it, has spent a considerable amount of time and money to get them trained. If the commission needs me to know more about the specific dollar amounts we are talking about over the past 10 years, for an example, I am prepared to investigate that if you need. However, I would like to see the police commission begin a thorough investigation of the management practices of Chief Agrafiotis over the past 10 years and determine if those practices are indeed the cause of so many good police officers leaving our town for other jobs. I would like to see non-public, confidential interviews executed by this commission of those employees who have left Hooksett over the past 10 years and see if there is any truth into what I believe is common sense that the Chief of Police is at the root of the unrest with our police department. I support all police officers in the town of Hooksett and as taxpayers, we deserve much better management than what is currently in place. Chief of Graffiotis, I do not want you to take my statements personally, as they are simply my right as a taxpayer in this town to get to the root of the problem. I believe at the heart you are a very honorable man and had great intentions when you took over the town's police force. Through time and poor management practices, however, our police force exists in its current deplorable condition, and we taxpayers need to hold your management practices accountable for its current state. We are at a point in time where I respectfully would hope you would do the honorable thing for the town of Pooksit and resign your position as police chief, make amends where appropriate, and then after Pooksit, or after things settle down in a year or so, come back to the town of Pooksit and offer your services as a community liaison officer to prove your most honorable intentions. If you choose to remain and listen to the people who are around you who are obviously giving you bad advice, you will leave your office in a most dishonorable way, and even as this chief, I do not wish upon you. Commissioners McHugh and Parolian, I want to thank you for taking your personal time to volunteer to work on this commission. As the majority of folks at residents who cannot attend appreciate your reasonable actions, attentiveness to detail, and fairness that you approach every issue that comes before you. Commissioner Roy, I respectfully request that you consider resigning from your current position on this commission. And I submit my request to you based upon the countless hours of videotape I have watched of you interacting with the citizens of this great community and your behavior as a commissioner has been, in a word, disappointing, to say the least. 